Yo! What up, everybody? It's your boy. You know what time it is. It's time for 2017-18 Upper Deck Series 1 Hockey. Half case break number four, eBay style. Let's do some hockey, eh? I don't know. Anyway. Five boxes of this. And I'm definitely going to assassinate some of these names. Not butcher. I'm, I'm talking like straight up. Somebody put a hit out on these boys. I'm going to butcher those names that bad. Assassination style. Alright. Before though, I do that. It's only right. Abraham. Good luck, everybody. <laughs> Looks like he's in a good mood. All right. Uh, let's see what we get up out of here. Now, I know the stuff to look for in this is the young guns. They will be... I will sleeve them, and we'll also top load them as well. Uh... I don't think there's that many autographs in this thing. I think there's like two autographs total in a case. You know, spoiler alert people. This is like... Honestly, this is the third break I've ever done of hockey. Like, literally. So, uh... Yeah. Have I ever seen a hockey game? I have not. Do I know anything about hockey? I know there's a hockey stick, and I know there's a hockey pug. And I know the, the object of the game is to score. And have more points than the other team at the end of the, the, the match. And I also know that there may or may not be fighting. Beyond that, I don't know who's good. I don't know who to look for. I don't know none of that. So I apologize in advance. If you were looking for some, like, commentary. <laughs> the only commentary I can provide you is uh, the slaughtering of these names. Right, uh, Alba. Pretty much, that's what I've been told is the young guns. There, There's some canvas cards of young guns that are, are, are worthy of noting. Let's see what happens. I would love to go to a game though, Snipe, you know what I mean? Probably be fun. It'll give me a reason to wear a jacket, because I, I can only assume it's cold inside the arena. Given the fact that they are skating on ice. Alright, I'm almost done here. All right, Alba, uh, I'm assuming you're in this break. I believe you are, so I wish you the best of luck, man. What are, what are you looking to hit in this? Let's, let's put it out there into the universe, and let's see if uh, Cardboard Moses can leave you to the promised land. All right, good luck, people. All right, here we go. All right. Young Guns, here we go. We have Josh Ho-Sang, the Young Gun. Islander Another young gun will butcher of the devils Not not too bad so far With the names anyway Alex Formanton for the Senators, Young Guns. That's what we're looking for in this stuff is the Young Guns. 
Well, Alba, we also have a, a stream on YouTube. If you want to check us out there, just look up Rip City Cards on YouTube, all one word, and you're going to see that we live. There's a portrait, but it ain't a young gun, so from what I hear, it doesn't really matter. CJ Smith, young gun for the Sabres. Damn fits already. You got a strike. You got to get one against good. There's an upper deck canvas, but it's not a young gun. Portrait. I have not seen the video, no. I know he filmed it in, in Miami, though. And he gave away close to like a million dollars to like people and stuff. But I didn't get I didn't get even even a nickel of that, so I don't care. Uh, all right, here we go. Vladislav Kamenev for the Nashville Predators, I think. With the young guns. We have Nicholas Curdiles, the Young Guns, and it is see through. Rockets have uh, Chris Paul and Harden autos in there. Niceness. They're probably extremely hard to get, hence the price. But if you hit them, oh boy. That's a good deal. Young Guns. Here's a Young Gun canvas for Pierre Lou Dubois of the Blue Jackets. Should it should have hit me up, man. That would have been that would have been nice. Slide me a cool ten thousand dollars. That'll help me put some things in in in, in order. Did I pass something, Brian? Did if I did, let me know. Victor Arvidsson, the Shining Stars. Well, Leslie, I'll be honest. I I don't know anything about this to be real with you. All I know is there are young guns in this deal. And that is the hotness. Adrian Kempe. Right here. Uh, Travis, I, I literally just put it up like maybe five, ten minutes ago. Uh, as far as the short prints, honestly, I don't even know there were short prints in this. So. Well, I, all this stuff is shipping, Brian. Just, you know, depending on who you bought. This you know inserts get sleeved. I just really focus on the young guns and the canvas because I heard that's that's the super uber hotness. But everything that needs to get sleeved, like inserts, numbered cards, things of that nature, they will be get sleeved and they will go to their team. And as far as short prints, honestly, I've I've never done this. You know, I've done a couple of these for eBay because, you know, my partner puts it on eBay. But I have no idea about this product at all. So when people tell me, hey, you skipped something, you know, hey, whatever. I go back and I give it the tender love and affection it deserves. And then I learn. Which is how I know up to this point that the, uh, the Shining Stars... What you really want are the red ones. The red shining stars are a little bit better. So I go ahead and just sleeve those automatically. The young guns. The canvas young guns particularly too. 
And if I come across an autograph, a patch, or a number card, I sleeve and top load those too. The Young Guns, by the way, also get top loaded. I need actually, now that uh, the short print business has been brought to my attention, I'm going to go ahead and hit the old Google machine and see how to figure out what is a short print in this deal. In this deal. I'm sure there's a code or something. Yeah, we ship every card per team. You know, so as long as you bought your team or whatever, you can be assured that, you know, it's coming out to you. Uh, but Leslie uh, did raise a good point in me going a little bit quick. So I'll definitely, definitely slow it down so. And there's also the, uh, the be beautiful, wonderful feature that is uploading videos to YouTube where you can watch it at like twice the slower speed if you need to. So there's that. Oh damn, Brian! In their new, in their new house, Mojo. Right, right, right. Ex exactly. Ah, see, there's a veteran base. I did not know that. So the veteran base all goes to one spot, meaning that if you bought a team, you will get all the numbered cards, autographs, patches, rookies, and inserts. From what I hear, Brian, there is serious dough in hockey case breaks. But we rarely do hockey. Uh, not only on eBay, but just on our website, Rip City Cards, either. But I do, I will say, the cards are pretty, pretty cool looking. So I can, I can dig that. Speaking of hockey, I do have this uh, these Grandeur coins uh, listed on our website. Connor McDavid, Shining Star. I know that's a, a big name. I know that because Sports Center told me. They say his name a lot, so you know why not? All right, there's a canvas card, but it's not a young gun. There's a young gun for Jack Roslovic. I'm trying with these names. I'm trying. And the fact that I know absolutely nothing about hockey does not help the situation. So that's probably why I go a little bit faster than I should. Just to like, just to be done with it, honestly. There's a Sidney Crosby Shining Stars. I need to get all my hockey stuff, man. Nicholas uh, Backstrom Shining Stars insert. Canvas card. There's a patch for Andrew Shaw. Uh, what team he play for? I don't even know what team that is. Let me see if they put it in the description there. No, of course they don't. I have no idea who he plays for. It doesn't say it on the card, so I don't know. But there you go. Katie, thank you. Uh, James Van Rimsdick. <laughs> uh, who he play for? For the Maple Leafs, it looks like. The Shining Stars. Dude, I, I don't know shit about hockey, so... Definitely struggling. Definitely. Uh, Tyson Jost. For Colorado and whatever their team is. Uh, let's see on the back. The Avalanche, I think. Maybe. I don't know. There you go. Tyson Joss for the Colorado Hockey Organization. Uh, 
Brian is full of good suggestions today. I like it. I didn't even know I could do that. Tage Thompson for the Blues with the Young Gun. Oh, you, you don't do things like that by accident, Brian. You meant to do that. Well, Chris Fitz, that's honestly all I have going for me. One of one of few things, but it is something I got going for me. I don't even know where I'm at because I got a big ass stack of cards everywhere. Brack Bo Brock Boy Sayer is the young gun you want to hit. Says Ra Ra. Christian Fisher for the Coyotes, young guns. There's an autograph. That's nice. It's a signature sensation for Nino Niederreiter. I think that's how you pronounce that. Uh, who he play for? The Minnesota Wild? I think. Maybe. I don't, I don't know. I'm going off. Yeah, it is the Wild. Look at that. That vision is nice. There we go. All right, all these stacks gives me doubt. Doubt that I skip something. So I'm gonna do something I do not like to do. Oh wait, never mind. That's the old one. That okay. All right. All is well back in the universe, people. Never mind. Travis Sanheim of the Flyers. What do we got here? Anders Jork. I think the B silent on that for the Bruins. I know, I know, Brian. I know. I just don't really show them the love they need, I guess. I know these are the portraits. Says portrait. Um, but I've only been focusing on the young guns because word of the streets is that's all that matters. So for the interest of time, mm, that's what I do. Otherwise, people, I'd be here forever. It's already been 20 minutes <laughs> and I've only done two boxes. I need monster. Well, no. Actually, yeah, I do. I could use a monster box to put all that in. Seriously? Tunnel kick me in.
Is it better for you on YouTube, uh, Haas? Rosmus Anderson of the Flames. Uh, usually immediately afterward, Bryant, if I'm not, if I'm not, uh, super busy with breaks. Rasmus Anderson of the Flames, Young Guns. Yeah, usually right after Leslie, I post it up. Um, for the same reason, like, I understand you guys, you know, you spend your money on this stuff, so you really want to see every single card. So, I, I do show every single card. I know I go a little bit quickly than you like. But, you know, for the interest of time and trying to fill other breaks, you know, we, at least you are here to see the live show, which is awesome. Uh, but we do post the video, like, within 30 minutes, right, Leslie? Within 30 minutes uh, on YouTube. Ivan Barbashev for the Blues, the Young Guns. And what makes it even better is once I post it on YouTube, you can watch it, you know, at a slower speed, and you can mute me. Which makes it even better. So you don't have to hear the stupid shit I have to say. Alright. We have Hayden Flurry of the Hurricanes. Young Goons. Evgeny Shevnichov. <laughs> no. Uh, let's try that again. Evgeny Zvezhnikov for the Red Wings. The Young Gun. I appreciate that, Leslie. There's a Sidney Crosby canvas card. Again, we do sleeve all those cards. No worries on that. Um, again. Interest of time. I still got three boxes to go. Uh, the S is silent in in, in, in Veshnikov. Nice to know. Um, I think that might be a Russian thing. Uh, Victor Arvidsson. Shining Stars. I think he played. Who he play for? I think he played for the Predators. I think. Or whatever that cougar looking animal is. The Predators. Boom. Says it on the card. I think I got it. Alright. Why is that dude playing soccer? He's supposed to be playing hockey. Tisk tisk. Is, is, is really the S silent in Russian? Is that really a thing? Oh, you mean for the Predator? Whatever. The Nashville Predators. There you go. My next guess would have been like Sabretooth because it looked like a Sabretooth Tiger. Uh, Alexander Nylander of the Sabres. Speaking of a Sabretooth Tiger. What's the logo on that? Oh, it's a saber like a sword. Ah. I'm teaching myself Russian. I've been teaching myself Japanese my entire life, so I'm, I'm, I'm there with you. Uh, rah, rah. Uh, are you any closer to, to, to hooking up with any uh, any Russian ladies? There's a patch for Tyler Seguin. Uh, who that team be? Let me see if I can use my 2020 vision. Uh, Dallas Stars. That's who he play for. A lot of hockey stars warm up playing soccer. Really? Nice to know. It so hold on. So I got a question. Are hockey and soccer like similar or something? As far as like the uh, the offsides rules and things like that. Uh, Carey Price. I don't know what team that is, but I know it's a shining star. I can't read the name anywhere on that uniform. Well, yeah, that team, Casey Price. 
Am I gonna break World Cup stickers? Um, possibly. If I think it'll make me money, yeah. Oh, the Canadians, Casey, Carey Price, Canadians. I was just, I was just fooling. I knew who that was. Uh, J T. Comfer for the Colorado Avalanche. Maybe is that what that that team is? Yeah, it is. I read it. Boom. Reading is crucial, people. Young Guns, Upper Deck Canvas. That's nice. What I from what I hear in the streets. Or, or on the ice, I should say. Right? Right? No? Okay. What do we have here? I wonder if the short prints in this are like... In some of the other sets where... If they're like in warm-ups or something, it's a short print. How would I even tell? I'm sure there's like a code or something. That would tell me. No? Whatever. We have Carey Price of the uh, who that, Oh, that's the Canadians. Come on now. Everybody know Carey Price play for the Canadians. Everybody know that. I guess it is a thing, huh? Warming up playing soccer. That's cool. I wish soccer was more popular in the States. Because it's like the shit around the world. This is going to have to get randomed, I'm going to assume. Two different teams on there. Got uh, Nico Hishie and Brock Boisere. So, uh, that's probably something somebody's going to want. I hear the Brock is a, is a good one. We got Lucas Sedlak, the Young Gun Clear business. That is that is fancy. That is fancy. I like the clear cards. So I'm going to go ahead and top load this. You know what? I don't like how it fits. So I'm going to go ahead and throw another, another T loader at it. Oh yeah, that's just that's just gonna slide right on in. That is nice. These are the acetates. Hmm. It's in there pretty nice. What else we got? Yeah, seriously, soccer is a thing. The portraits. Nice beard on that dude. Nicholas Backstrom, the Shining Star. Young Guns. All I, all I care about are the Young Guns. The Nico and the Brock. So this card is pretty nice, apparently. Two big ballers on there. How was it in Miami today? You had 18 inches of snow to clear? Well, you'll be happy to know that uh, I did not have to get up to to, uh, to move not even a millimeter of snow. Or, well, hold on. That's Let, let me not use the metric system. We are in the States. Uh, I did not have to, not even an inch of snow did I have to, did I have to pick up. Because I'm in Miami, dog. It don't never snow down here. It's probably going to get cold. It was a little cold last night, actually. Now that I think about it. Now that I think about it. It was a little cold last night. It was in like the 60s. Which, I guess, you know, would be because it's cold up in the further north. Well, currently, if I, if I look at my phone, my phone tells me. You know, we, we chilling at that mostly cloudy 76. It snowed in Florida in December, but I mean, people from Miami and the rest of Florida, like, let me tell you something about Florida. You ready for this one? Here you go. So there's South Florida. Within South Florida, there's Miami. There's Miami, and then there's everybody else. 
we don't consider ourselves a part of Florida. We're like, we're from Miami. We're not from Florida. We're from Miami. There's a, there's a difference. Uh, well, Leslie, I know the numbered cards are on the front. I've seen those. I, I've, I opened up one case of this. And now this would be a case and a half. Well, Pappy, don't be mad. Don't be mad. Well, P well, Pappy, don't be jealous that uh, you know, I got I got this awesome weather down here. I also got to deal with hurricanes half the year, so there's also that. And you also got to take into consideration that we have a different level of heat down here. You know, we don't got that. We we got that wet tropical like jungle heat humidity out here is almost always above 90 percent it's hot as the dickens you step out the house and you need a shower you can't even get to your car and you're already parched it's both raw raw it's the heat and the humidity in combination You know, we're slowly cooking down here in Miami. Where the rest of you, you guys, you guys get preserved in that cold. That's what you look at us you're like, oh man, I would love a Miami tan. And we look at you like, oh man, I wish I was that. That preserved. Now, I, I, I know Leslie, they're, they're uh, right here on the side of that card. But for the uh, but for the but for the short prints, they're not th so they're just numbered. Oh, that's okay. So the short prints are the numbered cards. Ah, I think I, I think I'm understanding. Oh uh, well, no, Ra Ra. If you're fat in Miami, there's also many things to keep you from doing anything. Many many sights and. Not only that, but you also forget that we are in uh, this beautiful thing called a melting pot. You know, you know how many good shit there is to eat out here, bro. Dude, there is fire ass food everywhere you look, and not only that, but the old ladies that be working out here at restaurants in Miami, they be giving you extra food. Cause that's one thing about Mima. Mima gonna give you some extra food. You know what I'm saying? Or Mima or whatever you guys are used to calling Grandma. You know, down here we call it Mima. You know, it's a Cuban thing. So Mima, she gonna, she gonna fill that plate up full of food. And you gonna eat it too, goddammit. Because she, she slaved away all day fixing that for you. So you gonna scrape the plate. And you gonna eat it all. And then boom. You do that uh, three or four times a day for 20 years. You gonna be big. But on the plus side, losing weight super fast. Just go outside and run for a month and you'll be you'll be chilling. Vince Dunn of the Blues, Young Guns. Alright, so then the short prints aren't really like a thing. They would be numbered. Got it. Johnny Brodzinski for the Kings. Got you, Jordan. Got it. Got it. That's why I I, I I thought she was talking to me, but you know, I forget. I forget. Oh, you finally received those things, Tomas. So, for future reference, are all clear cards known as acetates? <laughs> Gabriel Carlson for the Blue Jackets? Well, Tomas, that, that should just, you know, 
maybe give us an incentive to rip open the other case. Who knows what's in that one? You know what I'm saying? Man, some of these names, boy. That's going to have to get random, I believe. Got a predator and a penguin. Two different teams. Got a Sidney Crosby or the Penguins. These Shining Stars. The red variation, which I hear are the most popping variation. Got Jake DeBrusque for the Bruins. <clears throat> Man, that dude look hard as fuck. Tuka Rosk. That's a hard ass name. That guy looks like someone I do not want to fuck with. That's a hard ass picture. Anyway. Oh, damn. How the... F All right. Well, <clears throat> Hold on, let me take a sip of this water before I try to pronounce this. <clears throat> All right, let's give this a go. Uh, young Gun for the Bruins, Jacob Forsbaka Carlson. Hey, that wasn't too bad. Got two boxes left. Fucking allergies, man. Uh, Victor Met of the Canadians, Young Guns. <clears throat> what is what do you call these? The acetates. Kevin Fiala. What is that for the Predators? The see through card. Clear cut is what it says on the back. <coughs> Gosh, man. Never fails, bro. Never fails in this office. Dude, I have no idea, Jordan, but uh, definitely need to check on that, bro, because I got me coughing like crazy, dude. And then everybody in this office was sick at some point, apparently, which means I'm up next. And I have not been taking any medicine or anything to, like, fight it, so bring it, bitch. My immune system versus the flu. Who's going to win? Who knows? I just got the... the Maybe I'm pregnant, but I just got the weirdest... Well, it's not really weird. But I, I would love uh, a sausage McGriddle right now. A sausage egg McGriddle. And breakfast is serving uh, all day at McDonald's. I might, I might, I might pick one up. I might pick one up.
Jeez. Put it some more away. I need more boxes. Alright, let me put this away so I don't confuse these brakes here. And I need more boxes, so. Two boxes left, and I got a break coming up in 15 minutes. I can do this. Sorry, Leslie, but uh, I'm gonna speed things up here. And truth be told, I spend more time opening up the packs than I do going through them. Damn, contenders teams have been going here. <clears throat> nice to know, nice to know. Yo, Fitz, are there really uh, Harden and Chris Paul autographs and contenders? It's probably like a stupid low number on those. Like six total or something. The, the, you know, parallels to five and then the 101. Kyler Yamamoto of the Oilers, Young Guns Canvas. Got Carter Rowney of the Penguins, Young Guns. Elias Lindholm. Not sure what team that is. Doesn't say. Great. 
Well, whatever that team is, Eliza Lindholm with a patch. <coughs> God. So uh, the Lindholm goes to the Carolina Hurricanes, says Jordan Miller over in the YouTube chat. Shout outs to him. Because my hockey knowledge is close to nil. Alex Kerfoot of the Young Guns going to the Colorado Avalanche. Only reason I know that is because somebody told me. Ah, so Harden has 12 autographs. And Chris Paul has... Hmm, okay. So you got, you got, a, you got a little shot at him. Ian McCoshin for the Panthers. Hey, look, we, we switched our uniforms up, I think. I'm not a fan of those. If Those are our actual uniforms. Getting, getting better at the names. Now I just need to know the teams. And then before long, you're going to be seeing some more hockey stuff in the store. Listen, if it makes dollars, it makes sense. You know what I'm saying? I'll rip anything. John Hayden of the Blackhawks. Young Guns. <clears throat> you go get me a beverage or something. John Gillies of the Flames, Young Guns, and almost there, James Van Rimsdick, the Shining Stars, Red very a shown a Kaler Yamamoto Young Guns Oilers thingy Oh, there's a a parallel. Numbered 54 out of 100, Drake Kagula. There you go, Katie. You should do that, like, all the time. Those, those always brighten up my day. All right, so this one is going to the Oilers, according to what I read there. <clears throat> Connor McDavid portrait. Which is a uh, probably a big deal for the Oilers. You're gonna send me a on a plane in a crate? I don't think that's I don't that's not nice. The kitty's gonna hate me once it once it actually gets to me. Can you actually do that? I wouldn't mind a cat. Cats are uh, pretty, pretty independent, pretty low maintenance. I think.
I'm down, Katie. If you if you seriously send me a, a cat, I mean I can't keep it at the office. It's not the first time somebody sent me some pussy. Hey, I could have helped myself. I had to make the joke. All right. <coughs> <clears throat> the back of my throat is itching. That's what she said. Seriously, though. <clears throat> Katie, you know I got a potty mouth. Don't act like you're surprised. There's a Durant Auto to 124. Damn, so there's a decent chance to get those. And you bought them already. Smart man. So Katie, did y'all book your uh, did y'all book y'all flight for August already? I'm gonna make Dan cook me something from y'all hotel room or something. Terrence Ferguson is a low key rookie for the Thunder. That's gonna be nice. I think he'll I think he'll be decent. Drive it. Seriously? How long would it take for you guys to drive to Cleveland? Alright. Last box mojo. Good luck, peeps. Got Nathan Walker of the Capitals. We have Alex DeBrincat, Blackhawks. Katie, as long as as long as it's not um what's it called? Dairy or fish? Cause I, I'm lactose intolerant, and I can, and I, and I absolutely hate fish. I cannot eat it. So as long as it's not any of those two things, I can't wait to put it in my mouth. Connor McDavid for the Oilers, the shining stars. To uh, yeah. Well, listen. He, he 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 Who says he is? There's there's Uncle Jesse, and then there's there's and then there's that, and then there's that. All right. There's nobody else. Uh, Brock Boy Sayer of the Canucks. That mother Canucker is a young gun. There you go. From what I hear, it's a good one. Well, uh, I saw that joke coming a mile away, Katie. Saw that mile coming a whole mile away. Still, well done, well played, well played. Comedic timing was there. You know, the fact that you're a chick gives it like even more, more oomph, if you will. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm going to give that a 9 out of 10, Katie. Good job. I did open the door and you, and you shut it right on my sausage. Well played. Well played. I always I can I always can appreciate a nice uh, nice exchange of witty banter. Honestly, it keeps me going every day. You know, oh, I can't wait to get to the office. Let's see what kind of shit we can talk with the peeps today. Robert Hag of the Flyers, Young Guns. <clears throat> All right. 
right, and the last stack here, what do we have? Samuel Morin of the Flyers. Number 21 out of 25, a portrait for Nazem Kadri of the Maple Leafs. Go ahead and top load that. Got a uh, Dennis Gurionov of the Stars, Young Guns. Kyle Palmieri. I think that's for the Devils. The game jersey patch. What else we got? Almost done here. And uh, there's that card that we actually have to random, uh, which is the finality of the break. Breaks over, uh, but not quite, because we actually have, like I said, some cards to random. There's these. And there's these. So the random is going to go as such. There's, you know, on each card, there's a team on the left and on the right. So that's how we're going to do the random. All right. It's either going to go to the left or the right side team. If I get an odd number, it's going to go to the left side. If I get an even number, it's going to the right side. Odd left, even right. Odd left, even right. It's going to go to the left side team, odd numbers. So these are going to go to the New Jersey Devils, I believe that's the name of the team. And these are going to go to the Predators. Alright, let me write that down. Boom. So, are you, wait, the Lakers are the only team left or the biggest, like, most expensive team left? All right, to recap this deal, we had some relics. Kyle Palmieri, I believe that's a New Jersey Devil. Elias Lindholm, was it the Hurricanes? Uh, Tyler Seguin for the Stars. And Andrew Shaw... I'm not sure what I think that's um, the Canadians. All right. Um, to recap, there are some shining stars here, but what uh, from what I hear, what's really hot in the streets are the Young Gun cards. Now, before I show those off, let me make sure there's nothing else in there. It's not a young gun. And these will get top loaded too as well. This one's a see-through? Yeah, it is. We're going to top load this. So there were a few things that we uh, top loaded. I'm going to show those off now. So there was a Nazem Kadri of the Maple Leafs to 25. A Drake Kagula to 100 for the Oilers. Kevin Fiala, the Acetate for the Predators. Top load is a little dirty. Alright. Lucas Sedlak. Um, what team that is? I'm not sure. I'm sorry, I'm not good at these. I don't know, I don't know hockey at all. And I can't tell what it says, but it's a Lucas Sedlak. Go, it'll go to his team. Uh, Nicholas Curdiles for the Ducks. Finally a team I know. The Mighty Ducks, baby. There was an auto for the Minnesota Wild, Nino Niederreiter. All right. And the Young Guns. Upper deck canvas of Pierre-Louis Dubois, Jack, the Blue Jackets, 
Uh, Kyler Yamamoto of the Oilers with the other canvas, Young Guns. We had Dennis Gurionov, Stars. Samuel Morin, Flyers. Hag Flyers, Boisir Canucks. I'm top of that now. Uh, the Brinkett Blackhawks, Walker Capitals, Yamamoto Orioles, uh, Gillies Flames, Hayden Blackhawks, McCoshin pa uh, Panthers, Kerfoot Colorado, Rowney Penguins, Met or Medi Canadians, Forsbaca Carlson Bruins, the Brusque Bruins, Carlson Blue Jackets, Brodzinski Kings, Dunn Blues. There's an upper deck uh, young gun for JT Comfer. Uh, bam. Nylander Sabres. Uh, Vechnikov Red Wings. The SS Island, apparently. Uh, Flurry Hurricanes. Barbashev Blues. Anderson Flames. Jork Bruins. I think the B is sure uh, silent. Sandheim Flyers. Fisher Coyotes. Or Coyotes. I've always wondered that. Thompson Blues, Josh Colorado, Roslovic, Winnipeg, Kempe Kings, Kamenev, Nashville, Smith Sabres, Formington Senators, Butcher Dever, uh, Devils, and Hosang for the Islanders. And those were the hits. And that was the break, peeps. 2017-18 Upper Deck Series 1 Hockey, half case break number 4, eBay style. Thank you very much. We'll get that right out to you.